Hello and welcome to this AIML tutorial. In this tutorial we will be looking at the topic tag. So the topic tag basically says if you have two patterns that are the same they they say the same thing but you need them for two different things then you can use the topic tag to divide them. So uh, in other words say you're talking about um, the place of a city for example and you put in um, I want to talk about London or I want to talk about Edinburgh and then as a follow-up question you say where is it instead of saying where is Edinburgh where is London so obviously if you had the same question for both of those you would um, have some conflicts and the topic tag is basically a way to remove those conflicts so let's give you an example as always we'll create a new category category pattern and in this pattern we'll put something like um, let's talk about elves and in the template we will use our think tag along with our set tag and the name is equal to topic and then <clears throat> in between the set tags we'll call the topic elves and then we'll give a, a response as well we'll say uh, yes let's discuss elves and then we'll make a new category just copy and paste that and we'll say let's talk about cats yes let's discuss cats because really why not and don't forget to set the topic as something like cats so now we're going to use our topic tag you just write topic name equals elves so this should be pretty self-explanatory but I will go over it you've got your opening topic tag and within that tag you have this name function which says if the topic which is the variable set here is equal to elves as you can see name equals elves then you can access whatever is put in between the topic tag um, if the ve if name doesn't if topic does not equal elves uh, you can't use it so now as normal we'll just create a new category pattern uh, what do they look like and in the template we'll put big pointy ears and you can have multiple categories within the same topic tag um, it really doesn't matter so now we'll create a new topic for our cat topic name equals cats and just the same as last time create a category and what oh in your pattern tag put what do they look like so as you can see we have two patterns which are completely the same but they're going to have two different templates uh, little furry things so they have two different templates but the patterns are the same now about these topic tags this would basically crash the program uh, it just wouldn't run so this is a very convenient way of allowing you to use multiple categories to answer a similar sounding question so now if we save that and we run it let's 
talk about elves and what do they look like cool so that's the response we expected and now if we wanted to back out of that topic and into a different one we would need to first set that topic in other words you would just write something like let's talk about cats and now that's changed the topic from elves to cats what do they look like cool cool so that's everything you need to know about the topic tag just to recap um, you set the topic within a set tag uh, the variable name must be topic and then you create your topic tag and inside of that topic tag you can put basically whatever you want you can have multiple categories um, you can even have another set topic variable and yeah that's it basically um, I just like to make one more note before the end of the video um, as you may have noticed I didn't use punctuation on the word let's there should be a uh, a thing there but there isn't and the reason for that is that by default AIML does not let you um, enter punctuation into your pattern you can put it in a template but I think it's the that tag and the pattern tag doesn't allow punctuation and there is a workaround for this which I may discuss in a future video but um, that's all we have time for for this one so thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next time